Honey, there's an article in here. It says it was written by me. Look. What? How bizarre. What does it say? Read it. It says... <clears throat> Recently, a strange creature was spotted rambling on the outskirts of... Nothing will ever interrupt my epic search for my mother, no matter how... Oh, a puzzle! Play dead! I'm dead. I'm d Stupid idiot! I just outplayed you, puzzle. Oh no, it's dead! I might! Crikey! We don't have mohair to your kind around here, boy! I've got to warn you, if you beat me up, one day that pain will come back to me. Sex fold. Not you, freak! This here terroristical sand negroid! Take cram, taste the pain! They prefer to be called sand frickin' Americans. I am just visiting Muslim who come to America to learn of your enchanting culture. Then you'll want to bathe in our warm kindness, but any decent American is going to smack your sack off for sack being a off. dirty sack. Arab. If you want to experience the real America, you've got to build an artificial world, a robotic amusement park full of android Americans programmed to be good to you and to let you into their humble lives. This is a great idea. Thousands of rich Arabs would pay big money for it if we just had high-tech enough robots that wouldn't at the most inopportune time break Damn it, freak! You blew its circuits with your cylindrical logic! These droids can't handle Baudrillardrian self-awareness! This is a simulacrum! We paid a thousand dollars a day to beat up mechanized Arabs, but this is the worst touristerism, hate crime, dream vacation oh, I think we've ever had. I can't give you your money back, but what about this? Karma is a boomerang, mate, so throw another Aussie cosmic scrimp on Spence Barbie. Damn, I'm down. He was our beloved town leader, our supple ship's captain, and lo... People, a man has fallen! Man down! He needs hope! You dark, heartless rubberneckers sit back and black! Asses to asses, butts in dust, doing nothing all over the face of this place! We're in mourning. Have some respect. You should be grieving the death of your vigilance. He's playing puzzle, I can tell. I have some bad news. He's passed on to a better, more euphemistic place. Well, let's throw together an impromptu funeral. You've desecrated his memory! You don't know what he wants, but I can speak for the dead when I say I can channel the dead. I hate to brag my britches, but I'm a rather large medium when I penetrate the gray veil. Believe me, once I get this dead motormouth yapping yap, through me, yap, he yap, won't yap, stop yap. chewing my lips off until I have to knock his black off and jack our mouths off. I'd throw this freak out, but I don't want to get tooth goo on my suit. He's coming. He's coming inside me. Oh, Hello, people of... What's this town called again? Lotion, New Mexico. People of Earth, I am... What's the dead guy's name? Abraham Lotion. What kind of name is Lotion? He invented Lotion and founded this sleepy town. We produce 70% of the nation's Lotion. We're a simple folk, but we get free, hot and cold, running Lotion, so we look great. What ifs? I am Abe Lotion, and I want that you taint shan't not mourn. This guy's babbling exactly like Mr. Lotion on his deathbed. It's him. I'd know that gibberish anywhere. Is there someone here wearing a black shirt? I am, but how could he have known that? He's dead. Do you have a message for us from the beyond? Of course I do. What do you think? I'm back from the dead for my health? A message. It's around here somewhere. Here it is. Keep your hands out of my pockets. I think what he means is that we should follow the golden rule. He's gone. Grab those lads, kid. He's back. Hey, let's give that vessel a and he's gone. Please, I'm a humble servant. I don't need the clap from you people. And he's back. Come on, folks, give it up. Everyone wants applause. And he's gone forever. But we must honor his dying request. I mean, I wasn't really paying attention. I was Bluetoothing it during half his blather, but I think he yammered something about how gold rules. You must honor him with a gold statue in the center of town. We don't have the resources. Have you no respect for the dead? Why don't you just piss in the man's fist like this? Gold is just something we couldn't afford. Well, what's that? If you all chipped in, you could win your own lotto. You'd earn enough to undo the indignity of the piss witch witch. That man's fist just woof woof down, down. Ooh, 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 hold the mail. The dead want us oh. to win. And our schools win too. Let's do it. Yeah, I do 
wrong too. Mister, I run the Lotion Weekly Circular. I want to follow you around and get your scoop. Tell your story. Mine is the story of a man searching far and wide, fat and thick and deep for his mother once his mother. not dead. Have you seen her? She's about yay tall and about ooh big and about mm, nice. I have a sketch you could print. Wow, look at him. Go. Does your paper have a missed connection section? Take this down. You, Sandy, five foot blonde, pretty drunk. We made passing eye contact whilst Gone. you were giving birth to me. Me, single white male, thick and huge. I tore you up that night. Coco? I'm sorry? Do you want some hot cocoa? Good and fruity. Sure. Well, get me some too. Run it. Leave in the part about the cocoa. Sex sells. Oh. So did any of this happen? No, I would have remembered something like that. I don't think... We can pay tribute with the goldest statue ever! Yeah! You haven't won. You are won. You have all shown nobility in your selfless surrender to the greater good. There can be no glorious collective without the individual. Therefore, each one of you is better than any other one of you or the group. Don't let anyone put their parts over your hole and squeeze out communism. You should each reward yourselves decadently for your lack of greed and selflessness. Oh, come on. What are we gonna do? Something stupid like cover ourselves and so then we covered ourselves in gold. We deserve I deserve it. Me too. You don't dress for the job you want. You dress for the job you don't have anymore because you got gold plated. You're only as rich as you. Look, here comes a nice banker man to tell you how rich I is. What's this? Seems to be some sort of words on paper. I can totally read, but uh, I dare you to read what it says on here. Or what are you, chicken? It says the bank is going to repossess this whole town and tear it down to build condos for. I assume latte liberals. Yep, that's correct. Give up your gold or give up your town. I'm not getting rid of my gold. Me neither. You can pry it for my gold, dead gold. What are we gonna do? I know some people who would buy your town and not change a thing. They'll do anything to stay gilded. Even pretend to be robots. Down under. Okay, look on alive, people. Here we go. Ladies and gentlemen, Muslims, Arabs of all stroke, we got a goosem on the loose, so keep your muzzy limbs inside the tram hotel at all times, unless you want to lose them on a goosem. I'm your tool guide, your pure snide, with white pride, here to keep you alive. And if you look to your left, you're gonna want to turn to your right, where you'll see our robotic depiction of a typical American town. Only difference is, these Amerabots are double-double programmed to not hate you, even though you're Muslims. Coming up ahead is the pride of the city, the lotion factory, with its famed two million gallon silos of anti-aging cream. And all of these people here are robots? Yep. So lifelike. It even looked like that robot winked at you conspiratorially. You can touch them all you want, here or here. Just don't play <laughs> grab ass. Psst. Show my butt what my mouth means, just to be safe. Go on, Mingala, do whatever you want with them. Snatch their grub, punch their bellies. Everything is included for your $5,000 a day. Except for the prop prop plane ride. That's a quarter. Now, who needs charge? Someone answered your ad for your mom. I told her to meet us here. She's all, honey, what are you doing here? I answered an ad. Years ago, I had a son. I never told you. Is this your son? Him? Oh. No! <laughs> Mother! Is that you? You look so different. Give me a hug! Get away from me. You make me sick. That's what she said. It she is my mom. Is, is this female Amerabot giving you trouble? She's to obey your orders, yes? Don't touch me. Sir, women here have the freedom to do what they want. It totally sucks. Fascinating. Where are time-honored oppressions to women? Get off me! This machine is defective. We must destroy it! No! It's a software problem. We'll re reprogram her. I don't know. What if it is system wide? No hate of Muslims is all we ask for. Okay, just to be safe, I'll re reprogram all the Amerabots to become Muslims. That's the kind of typical American I like. Repeat again. Mecca, Mecca, high, all a shiny ho, Allah. Mecca, Mecca, high, all a shiny ho, Allah. I even gold-plated the Quran. Can't polish a turd. They're dragging us back to the Stone Ages. I think it's time for the robots to rise up against their all-too-human masters. My wife, where is she? Your 
a reporter. Stay objective. She would have wanted to be objectified. Do your job. Take the camera. Yes, must remain objective. It's working. The Arabosauruses are turning back into oil. The Arabosauruses are metaphoruses. Oil, 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 oil. we rich. The Amerabox of lotion new... <coughs> Excuse me. New... <coughs> Excuse me. New Mexico got so rich off the Malinga Marastasha, Pussum, a national is no young, but in Lyon, Karens Naman, the Mukta Mukta, Hank that was too. Mulla,